Hey guys, Dylan Schumacher with Citadel Defense, and today we are going to take a look at uh, my current plate carrier setup. So I'll just kind of go through what I got here. This is in general kind of my level two or line two gear, right? Uh, so starting on the uh, front, because that's probably the easiest place to start here. Uh, so I currently run four mags up front here, and this is on a Haley Strategic chest rig. Uh, this is the old Gen 1 with this pretty worthless uh, multi pouch thing up front here. The new ones don't have this, they got rid of this, and then they just gave you four pistol mag pouches or, or grenade pouches or flashlights or multi-tool or whatever you can fit in here kind of across the front. They realized this was not very useful um, and got rid of it. So that's what that is. I just kind of try to tighten that up a lot. I might eventually just cut it off. I've been debating about that. There's really not a whole lot of use for it. Love the rig, otherwise just not that pouch. It has these two kind of smallish little GP pouches on the side, um, but you can just put kind of general items in. Right now there's nothing in this one. I don't run any, oh, that's not true. I run a uh, handcuff key on a piece of uh, paracord that can be removed. Uh, on that side, on this side, I run the actual handcuffs that, uh, that that key goes to. So that's what happens on that side. Uh, the mags, the mag pouches themselves have a plastic insert at them, in them so that you can index them in easily. Uh, I run all that except one. My theory here is this is kind of my last ditch mag. No matter what happens, I will always have this mag because it has a bungee on it. Uh, I don't want to mess with the other bungees because in general um, I like to keep my mags easier to access. Uh, now granted my primary reload is off my belt, right? If you've seen my uh, belt battle belt video, I run two mags off my belt. So these are not my primary reloads, but I still like them easier to index and re-index. And when you have a bungee like this, it's harder to re-index the mag. And that's what I'm more concerned about with that. I don't run any uh, pistol mags up front because I run those off my belt and I just don't need the extra weight up front. Um, if I'm down to my fifth pistol mag uh, and I'm all out of rifle bullets and I'm having a really really bad day and something went horribly wrong that that last pistol mag probably is not going to fix right so uh that's the front that's ammo so my, my theory here is i want to keep all the mission essential gear up front right so mags and frags right uh so in this case it's just four mags across the front i have the handcuffs in here those float in and out you know they're not oh they don't live there uh, sometimes they're in there sometimes they're not but that's obviously it up front uh the chest rig itself has a little admin pouch, or not the chest rig, the plate carrier itself has a little uh, admin pouch up here. It's about that deep, it's how far I can fit my hand in. I never use that for anything, it's too awkward to get when it's actually on to try to undo this tab and stuff. Uh, so that's just not easy. Uh, for those of you who don't know, this rig is Velcroed on. So they have a piece of hard-sided Velcro here. There's soft-sided Velcro on your carrier. It flops down and then it's attached up here by these two buckles that buckle right into the plate carrier itself. The plate carrier is a AR500 plate carrier. Uh, I've been pretty happy with it. My only gripe is I wish I would have ordered it in multicam, but that's on me, that's not on them. I'm trying to get all my stuff to match these days to be cute. Uh, I will annotate it in here, but I believe it is a uh, Veritas plate carrier. I don't honestly remember, possibly a, t a Tostito. Um, I'm not honestly sure, so I'll have to double check on that. Liked it so far, very comfortable. Uh, the plates I'm running are level four plates. They're from Battle Steel, uh, so they're level four ceramic plates. Uh, I think they're about 100 bucks a pop. Really, really affordable at, for a level four plate. So a big fan of that. Uh, on the sides here, you do have two more kind of clips. Uh, the Cumberbund, I've attached uh, Swift clips so that I can I can tighten in that uh, chest rig closer to the carrier. I like that so it sits tight against your abdomen and otherwise this can kind of flop around a little bit but when this is pulled tight it, it sticks with you. I like all my gear to stick with me. Um, I don't want anything loose or bouncing around or whatever so as little of that as possible. Um, <clears throat> on the side here this is this is a med pouch obviously right as designated. This is also an AR500 
uh, pouch, and this is just a basic Medgear pouch. I will say there is not currently a tourniquet in here, uh, and that needs to change. I'm, I'm working on that. Um, but uh, I have other tourniquets. I just decided I want to get a ratcheting uh, tourniquet, and that's what will eventually either live on top or maybe live on the side right here, but there will be a tourniquet in here. I do carry a tourniquet on my belt and a, a leather med kit there, so this is a redundancy. Uh, now, some people will not like this, but I'm considering just removing this entirely uh, and just running my primary med kit off my belt. Uh, I know that's heresy in some circles, but my med kit's for me, it's not for you, so if I get shot, I'm the one who has to deal with it. But uh, this is a redundancy, not a primary med kit. Um, on the back, nothing much here. Let's see if I can turn this. Uh, I just have this carabiner because it's a climbing grade carabiner. I didn't really have anywhere to put it, and that's why I threw it on there. Okay, drag handle on the back, Velcro, Molly, blah, blah. Nothing too much going on there. Uh, so that's it. That's my plate carrier. It is exceedingly simple. Um, like I said, I'm just running mags and medical, and that's, that's really about it. So there's nothing fancy going on here. Uh, I think that is it. Would love to or not to hear any comments. I guess if you like it or don't like it, I really don't care. Again, it's my plate carrier. It's not yours. Do brave deeds and endure. <laughs>